Hello everyone. Today we are going to do class eight maths chapter number fifteen area practice set number fifteen point four. We are going to complete today. So let's start with the first example. Side of a triangle are forty five, thirty nine, and forty two centimeter. Find its area. Okay. So first we have to write what has been given. So sides of a triangle forty five centimeter. Thirty-nine centimeter and forty-two centimeter. Okay, now A is supposed to be forty-five, B is supposed to be thirty-nine centimeter, and C is supposed to be forty-two centimeter. Okay, so semi perimeter of triangle. S is equal to A plus B plus C upon two. Okay, so we have we are finding perimeter that is semi perimeter. For that, first we will add all the sides that have been given to us, and then divide it with two. The answer is going to be sixty three centimeter, which is supposed to be a semi perimeter or S. Okay. Now, after we get our S, we have to just write the formula that is area of triangle is equal to root of S S minus A S minus B S minus C. So that is why we had to find S that is semi perimeter. So that we will get our S, and only we have to just substitute in the following alphabets. Okay, so what is our S? S is supposed to be sixty-three. So sixty-three minus A is forty-five. So forty-five. When there is nothing, we have to add a multiplication sign over here. So sixty-three minus thirty-nine again multiplication sign. Sixty-three minus forty-two. Many of you all don't know that when we give a bracket, that means it is multiplication over here. Okay. Now, first we will solve the small brackets. Okay, that is subtraction because first we have to subtract all these numbers. So sixty-three multiplied by 18 subtraction multiplied by 30, 63 minus 39 is going to be 24 multiplied by 21 when you subtract these two numbers okay now simply we have to multiply or we can directly take the smaller version that is 97 the 63 okay 9 to the 18 8 Three's are twenty-four, and seven three's are twenty-one. Okay, children. I hope it's clear how I have taken. I have just taken. I have tried to take on the square roots now. Okay, so that I will get a squares. So nine. You will see that I am having two nines. So nine square multiplied by two seven. I am having so seven square. Okay, then three. Square I am having so three square and what is left eight to the sixteen so I will directly write sixteen because they are not a pair. I hope this step is clear. Or simply children you all can multiply it but it will be a bigger number. So when you do in this way it will be easy. Okay now when we have to remove a root you will see that first we will take sixteen. Four square is sixteen. So you will see now all the numbers are having squares. So when we remove the square, only nine into seven into three into four. Then it will be easy for us to just multiply these number after removing the squares and the square roots. Okay, so the answer is going to be seven fifty six square centimeter because it's an area. So the unit is going to be square. Area of triangle is seven fifty six square centimeter. Look at the measure shown in the adjacent figure and find the area of quadrilateral. You all can call this 
PQRS. Okay, you will see that we are having two triangles over your children. Okay, so this diagram has already been given in the textbook. So I will write the measures. That is length of PS is equal to 36 meter. Length of SR is equal to 15 meter. Length of PQ is equal to 56 meter. And length of QR is equal to 25 meter. Okay, so all the lengths that they have given, I have just written what has been given. Now we will find the area of first triangle that is PSR. Okay, so first we will find PSR which is supposed to be a 90 degree angle. Okay, so 90 sign has been already given in the uh, textbook, the figure it's been given. Okay, so the area of triangle is going to be half into base into height. Okay, or H. So, half, what is the base? No, first we will keep this as our first. Okay, then therefore the area of, area of PSR is equal to length of SR. What is the base supposed to be? Base is supposed to be SR. Alright, into height is how much? length of ps so ps is supposed to be a height i hope this is clear okay b is this at height is this much now therefore half into 15 into 36 i have just substituted the value of sr that is 15 and 36 as ps so i will reduce it Okay, so 2 ones are, 2 ones are, 2 eights are. So, 15 into 18 is going to be area of PSR. When you multiply 15 into 18, the answer is going to be 270 square centimeter. Now, we have got the area of this triangle. Okay, now what we will do is, we will take... PSR as a right angle triangle. Okay, so that we will get this side. We have got the area children. Okay, but they have mentioned that this is a 90 degree angle. So, if we take Pythagoras, we will get a hypotenuse. Then only we can add these by the perimeter formula. Okay, so we will get this area of PQR. Okay, now by Pythagoras or by PT theorem, Triangle PSR length of PR square is equal to length of PS square plus length of SR square. Okay, so length of PR square is equal to PS is how much? P and S is 36. Okay, and SR is 15 degree. Not degree, sorry. 15 square. Now, 36 square is how much? 1, 2, 9, 6. You all can multiply it and check. 2, 2, 5. When you add this, 1, 5, 2, 1. And L, P, R square. This is supposed to be P, R, a hypotenuse. Okay. So, when we have to remove the square, therefore, length of P, R, the square will change to this side okay now therefore length of pr is equal to 39 meters okay so 39 is the square of 1521 you all can check it by lcm method also okay now once you get 39 what you all have to do is 39 is pr isn't it so we have got this Okay, children, now you will see that P, Q, R, we have got all the three sides. Now, it will become very easy for us to remove the semi-perimeter that is S. So, triangle P, Q, R, P, Q is A which is 25, sorry, 25 meter. Q, R is B that is 56 meter and P, R is equal to C which is 39 meter. Okay. See. I have just name, named them. And I have written the 
sides okay now semi perimeter means the s is supposed to be a plus b plus c upon 2 which is supposed to be 56 plus 25 plus 39 upon 2 okay add this you are going to get 120 upon 2 that is 2 ones are 2 six are 60 so what is your s s is supposed to be 60 meter now we can very easily find the area of pqr that is area of triangle pqr is supposed to be s s minus a s minus b s minus c okay now substitute the value of s and a b c that is 60 60 minus 25 60 minus 56 and 60 minus 39 okay so once you substitute the values solve the bracket first that is 60 into 35 into 4 into 21 just subtraction we all you all have to do now we will take the easiest term in order to get the square root okay so 3 5s are 15 15 4s are 60 okay into 4 7s are into 5 into 7 into 3 so 7 3s are 21 okay so 4 i have taken as it is Okay, 4 I have taken as it is, 7 5s are 35, okay, and 3 5s are 15, 15 4s are 60. So, we have got all the terms now, just take the square root, 3 twice, so 3 square, 5 square, 4 square and 7 square. Everything is twice, you will see that I have tried to take all the numbers twice, okay, just excuse me for this. Okay, now when you multiply, no sorry, not multiplication, we have to remove the squares. So, 4 into 7. So, what is going to be the answer? The answer is 420 square meter. So, this is the area of PQR. So, area of quadrilateral that is PQRS is area of PSR because you will see we have found two areas so we have to add areas of both the triangles as I said there are two triangles so 270 plus 240 is going to be 690 square meter okay so therefore area of quadrilateral PQRS is supposed to be 690 square meter let's move to the next sum now over here Three triangles are been given. This figure is already been given children. You all can refer the textbook. I will write what has been given first. Same way as we solve the second sum, the third sum is also the same. Length of DC is equal to 60 meter. Length of BT is equal to 13 meter. So first we will find the area of triangle BAD. Refer the diagram as I am writing it. It's half into length of BA into length of AD. Okay, half into base. That is half into 10 into 9, which is supposed to be when you reduce it, the answer is going to be 180. Okay. Sorry, not 10 over here, it's 40. So, 2 ones are, 2 twos are 20. So, 20 into 9 is going to be 180 square meter okay so excuse me for this this is 40 not 10 now area of b d c is equal to half into length of d c into length of b t which is supposed to be half into 60 into 13 okay 2 ones are 2 threes are 0 so 30 into 13 is going to be 390 square meter Okay, now you all have got both the squares. So, what you all have to do, just simply add the areas of both the triangles. That is BAD 
plus area of BDC which is 180 plus 390 which is 570 square meter area of quadrilateral ABCD. I hope this exercise is clear to everyone. See you in the next video. Take care. Bye.